Hello, in this video, we are going to create a purchase voucher. So open your company file. Before creating a purchase voucher, make sure you create the supplier's account. So just go to accounts supplier, click on plus sign. I will just make a supplier name as Hemant Patel. And I'll just mention the rest of his details like email ID and phone number. And I'll just select the GST registration type as unregistered. If you are selecting the GST registration type as unregistered, so make sure when you are creating the voucher, you are not going to apply the taxes because the because your supplier, your creator, GST type is unregistered. Okay. And the second point, the RCM, that means the reverse charge mechanism has been disbanded. Okay. Now I'm going to fill up the necessary detail like address. 130 Fates Ring Road University area Ahmedabad Gujarat and I'll also mention the pin code 38009 and make sure you select the state that is also necessary state is Gujarat and pin code as well 38009 and now I'm going to click on save so my supplier account that is of Hemant Patel has been created and now I'm going to create an purchase voucher just go to transaction purchase record a purchase I'll just select the account as Hemant Patel as you can see from local to interstate it has been automatic changes changes that is because I've selected the status Gujarat and my company file is of Rajasthan. That's why it has been automatically changed. Now I'm going to add the item. Samsung. I'll just mention one. And read like this. And I'm not going to apply the taxes because it is of unregistered dealer. Okay. And I'm going to save. And I'm going to add a service as well. Like delivery charge. I mentioned the quantity rate 500. And click on save now as you can see discount and taxes you get two options one is the per item another is on total if you have items against which you are applying different taxes or different discount percent so make sure you're making the voucher in per item if not just make the voucher in on total now I'm going to create this voucher as on total and now I'm going to add the round off so that the my figure after decimal can be nullified. I'll just select add other expense round off. Now you can see the figure has been rounded off because it's now is 15781. 15781. Now I'm going to save the voucher and click on view purchase. As you can see, my purchase voucher has been created, and now I'm going to share this purchase voucher. As you can see the purchase PDF has been created and I'm going to send. After clicking on send I will get the messaging app from which messaging app I have to send this purchase voucher. Thank you.